Another week of my CCIE journey is in the books. My strategy changed a little bit this week, so let's talk about it in this video. Welcome back to the Data Knox YouTube channel. This is my CCIE journey, and if this is your first time visiting my channel and you'd like to learn more about IT skills or your IT career, just hit that like and that subscribe button, comment below, and even hit the little bell so you get notified when new stuff comes available. Not a whole lot of tech news happening in the world today, but I will share something that I think is incredibly cool. Boson, the exam sim and net sim tool of, you know, a lot of people love and use, has their summer sale going on. So if you jump into the description, Description below you'll find some links that will get you to the boson site and the promo code that you'll want to use is summer 20 that's gonna get you 25% off on the products on boson site look for me personally I went ahead and stocked up on exam sims these are exams that I may not take for a while but since they're 25% off I went ahead and bought at least the NRC exam right now all right now let's talk about the CCIE journey I am pressing forward on my CCIE journey and I'm still making progress very happy with how this week is going because I changed up my strategy a little bit. See, internally at CBT Nuggets, we kicked off the big course that I've been teasing for a while. We do have an internal kickoff where multiple trainers attend as well as marketing and other people. And we talk about how the course is going to flow and who's going to be recording what. This one, y'all, oh, it's gonna be big and it's gonna be amazing. I've already started recording for it. It's, uh, it's coming together very nicely. The flow is really locked on. Anyways, I'm giving away too much. You're gonna like it, I promise. I just can't talk about it for a few more weeks. But in light of this course being kicked off, and it is what I'm working on, I will say this spoiler for you. It is geared towards CCIE topics. It will meet CCIE objectives. So what I'm doing, my strategy now is to spend the first half of my day working on that content, labbing some stuff, studying some stuff, and then recording some stuff. And that will progress me towards those topics of the CCIE. But my main stressor about the CCIE remains routing, switching, and services. We know, based on the webinar that was taking place when they first kicked off the new CCIE exam, that the core of this exam, the CCIE exam, is gonna be based on routing and switching and services. They said that this basically took everything out of route switch version five and put it towards this and then added some stuff on top of it. So I know now that routing, switching, and services is going to be critically important in order to progress and succeed in the CCIE. So my strategy now is in the first half of the day, I'm gonna be working on this course, which does meet some CCIE objectives, but in the second half of the day, I'm going through the NRC textbook. Now, let me go ahead and say this right now, that I know that the CCIE lab will not be on the NRC textbook level. This is just to prep me for getting to the CCIE level. Now, I am already pretty comfortable with things like OSPF, EIGRP, and BGP. It's the second half of this book that I'm, I'm ready to work on. This is gonna be things like MPLS Layer 3 VPN, DMVPN, route redistribution, and security and services, and those types of things too. All of the second half of the textbook is the stuff where I really need to beef up my skills before I jump to the CCIE level textbooks. So at this point, I'm on, you know, page 270 or so, I'm in the advanced OSPF chapters. I've already blown through EIGRP and the routing fundamental section. Uh, so I'm making good progress. I started reading this, I think on Monday. Um, I expect that I'll probably finish this textbook in the next two or three weeks, and then I may sit down and read it again, or I may jump straight to the CCIE textbook. So really now, my CCIE strategy is going to be focused on some of these specialist type certifications and the other non-core routing and switching and services in the first half of my day and then maintain routing switching and services in the second half of the day all the way through to the CCIE lab exam. Now since I'm not revealing the juicy details about what I'm working on for a little while at least I figured something we could do in the meantime is get rid of some gear. Hmm? What do you say? After I got this new lab environment set up I had to pull a lot of stuff out of my rack 
like, now I've just got this gear that's just sitting here. So you know what? Let's let's make some room in my house and give some away. What we're going to give away here is a Cisco Catalyst 3750G. It doesn't do PoE, but at least it's got gigabit Ethernet interfaces, 24 ports. So let's give it away. So what I want you to do is comment below what you think the manufacture date of this device was. The closest one to it will win this device. So I went and exercised and then I realized I didn't really talk about how this giveaway is going to come to an end. First of all, international participants are welcome if you're 18 years of age or older. And I will announce the winner on Twitter at 12.30 p.m. Central Time on July 4th. So make sure you're following me on Twitter. That way when I make the announcement, we can DM back and forth. And that way we get the shipping information all handled that way. All right. Thanks for stopping by. I'll see you in the next one.